So GDSN stands for Global Data Synchronization Network. And it's essentially a pool of connected data that is used to both send and access standardized and normalized data from suppliers to retailers. Those are referred to as trading partners. What it means is smoother way of syndicating your data from internally to an organization to an external partner, because it is always uh, to meet a particular set of standards, which in this case is GS1. All the data pools are configured to meet GS1 standards. So because uh, you'll find that individual markets are interpreting GS1 standards differently, you'll find GDSN and pools tend to be market specific or region specific. And it's a many to many relationship, meaning that there are many suppliers of data going into a single pool where many retailers can access and pull out that data. Who's using GDSN right now? You'll find folks like Lowe's in the US and North America, um, Sephora sort of globally, Carrefour and France. Uh, major retailers across the spectrum and across the world are beginning to adopt GDSN pools because of the ease of accessing product data and imagery that can really drive efficiency on their end in new item setup, in adjusting content that already exists for existing products. It makes it smoother for them. And so they're asking their trading partners to invest in the time to make it smoother on the supplier side of that data.